All right, time to use Dudley for Brian Lowndes. I think his name was. Who asked me to use Dudley? This one's for you. I'm telling you, this isn't gonna be pretty. Cause uh, Dudley is not good online. Dudley requires red parries, not blue parries. The blue parries aren't important for Dudley. It's red parries that are important for Dudley. It's about getting punishes. And there's a lot of moves that people can use to spam against Dudley where you can't do anything or you can't do much if uh, they're spamming it. Like Akuma's Roundhouse Tatsu, you can't do anything about it that gives you decent damage. You might be able to do EX Uppercut. If you're lucky, it'll do full damage. Right? You might be able to do a super, but that won't do a lot of damage. And if you're lucky, I mean, not if you're lucky, but if you get the red parry, then you can do a full combo starting with Stan Roundhouse when they're, uh, when they're on the ground. I think I just played this guy. There we go. I don't know. But it was a leggy match. You'll see this. Even though it's yellow, you'll see him kind of moving around. There were a couple times where he just teleported in front of me and then just did a command throw. Bam! <sighs> Rose. Rose. Where the hell does he keep those? He ain't got no pockets. He ain't got no pockets. Fierce. Oh, that beats that. Alright. Oh, you should have done super, dude. You saw me whiffing that. Hope so. Hope you did at least. I hit his limb there. Ah, uh, I didn't want that parry, but I got it. Was that anti-air? Because that's what I meant. I wanted anti-air. I don't know. Well, there's one game with Dudley. Uh, what else is there? So, um... Yeah, Dudley really needs red parries. Not all the time, but like... If you're playing like Akumas, which you'll find a lot online, because he's one of those beginner level characters. A beginner level Akuma is going to spam a lot of Rados Hurricane Kicks, which is a really good move, actually. Let's be honest, it's a good move. And... Fuck, this thing's so loose. That's what she said. Hold on, let me see if I can fix this. And you really want to get that red parry in the last hit, or in the middle of it. Uh, also, Q, which is a terrible character, but if you play him right, he can be pretty dangerous. If he does the hand slaps on you and you block it, you're going to need to red parry that, because you want a red parry to get close, because he could be far away and still be blocking it, so you can't get a good punish. If you start, if you red parry the last hit, you can get a full stand roundhouse combo or a full crouching roundhouse combo if it's in the corner. So that's an example. It's like fuck the blue parries. Like blue parries, just you want to do Dudley. You want to parry a regular, do regular parries when you're standing outside of the character's um, footsie range. Uh. And you just want to try to parry like their little pokes, like the punches mainly. Not really, not even the feet. Stand out of the, stand out of range and parry hands. Don't parry feet. Which goes back to what I was saying the other day about like look for certain moves instead of parrying certain directions. When you're standing outside of uh, outside character length range of like low forwards, that's a good place to be generally. I mean, unless you've knocked them down, of course, be right in their face. But if you're playing against a Chun-Li, if you're playing against a Hugo, you want to make sure that you're parrying feet. No, sorry, parrying hands, not feet. Like his crouching jab, his crouching strong, his stand strong. And you can easily block his crouching forward if you need to. Give me someone good. Give me someone good. Come on, bro. I'm going to a shoe sale tomorrow with uh, my girlfriend, with Anna. I love her. I love her so much. I love her so much I'm going to a shoe sale with her. 
I, I'm just going to sit in the car and watch movies while she's, you know, shopping for shoes. Because I'm going to bring my playbook. I have a bunch of, like, TV shows and stuff on there. I checked out this show called Home Home Homeland today, starring, uh, I don't know, the guy that plays Dick Winters in Band of Brothers. And, uh, what else did I watch? I watched Vampire Diaries. That was a pretty bad episode. But I love that show. Girls are so hot in that show. So hot. Bonnie from Vampire Diaries? So hot. Amazingly hot. But I love my girlfriend, for the record. I love her. But Bonnie's so hot. <sighs> Dude, is there anyone else I can play? Well, I played you already. I haven't played you in a while. I wouldn't mind playing you. Come on, man. Oh, God. you gotta be kidding me. Is there a ban list? Is there a ban list? Can we get a ban list of some sort? Is there a way to only accept, like, orange and above connections? What do you guys think of the patch? I don't think this patch has done shit. Am I playing you again? Really? Fuck. <laughs> so, as you figured from the last game, if I just kind of zone this guy out and just be patient, he'll eventually do the uh, running grab. And I can just nail him with stand roundhouse. He did hit me with it the first time, though. I, I timed the roundhouse wrong. Yeah. And watch. I'm going to try to parry uh, hands. When he jumps in, I'm going to try to parry feet after he jumps in. Ooh. He loves that move. I tech that. Get meter. Don't do the lariat. Don't do the lariat. Where's running bear grab? Where's running grab? I parried that. See that? I said jump in and then parry feet. His foot. I tried to parry it. I blame leg on that one. That's an easy parry. It's an easy parry. I didn't mean to jump. See? Oh, I'm dead. That's right, you were looking for the parry. He's learning to pay more patiently, which is really good. He's using the terrible super. He knows I'm not going to jump a lot. I don't know why he's using that super. Oh. Where's my super, man? I'm supposed to do a super after that strong. That was easy. See, don't get parry happy. This guy's thinking, okay, I'm just going to jump in and parry a strong every time. So you should never formulate a plan that involves... I'm going to jump in and parry this. And then if you get hit, I'm going to jump in and parry that, and then I'm going to do it again, because he's going to count on me the same way. Because I can time that strong however I want. I can... I don't even have to strong. 
So he he was playing really badly there. He was doing all right in the first couple, like the first round, but like he was playing terribly by the end. He was getting anxious. He was too jump happy. I don't see the point. Why would you pick the anti air super and then decide that you're going to be the one in the air all the time? That's where's the logic in that? Where's where's the logic in that? It doesn't make any sense. I'm actually mad that he played that way. I'm actually mad. And you should be too. <laughs> Y'all should be mad as well. <sighs> I watched Persons of Interest tonight, episode 3. It was a pretty good episode. I mean, it advanced the storyline slightly at the very end. It's pretty good. I say that a lot. Pretty good. Also, when I'm playing... I say the words, uh, see that, see that, because I'm trying to show you stuff. Oh, fuck, fuck off, man. Go away. Go away. I didn't go to the arcade tonight. I, I got off work. I went home. It was like 6.30. I just crashed in bed. I, I was surfing around with my playbook for a while. And then at 6.45, I, I went to sleep with the intention of taking a nap, wake up, go to the arcade. Love Getty Station in Richmond Hill. And I just slept till 10.45. By the time I woke up, I was like, fuck this, man. I'm just going to fucking meet up with my boy Itchy and watch Persons of Interest. Damn, it's Sham. It's a fucking stupid fucking name. Shout out to Duralath, who sent me a message on Twitter. Andrew. Andrew. Cool dude. In case you weren't aware, he has a walk-on role, a recurring walk-in role, walk-on role in on, uh, I think it was General Hospital. I hope he goes to EVO next year so we can hang out, chill out at the buffets. I need a buffet date for EVO 2K12. Who wants to be my buffet date? Because uh, I'm going to pull the Xing Chang and try to conquer all of the buffets. I will be in Vegas. I'm calling it right now. I will be there three days before EVO. Three days. Please don't fast forward this. Listen to what I gotta say. It hurts my feelings when you fast forward through the video. This is terrible. This is so terrible. I'm gonna shoot myself. This is this is what's gonna cause me to shoot myself. How many matches have I played? Two? Both against the same guy? Who wants to take bets that he's the next guy I'm gonna I'm gonna like, you know, get a yellow one. Bets? Anyone? Anyone? Uh, so with Dudley, what I like to do a lot is, uh, especially against Hugos, you can option select low strong into super with super art 3 or 1, but he'll funny bounce if you do it with 1. Which is, if they jump in and they try to hit you, then you'll get a parry, and after the parry, you can do low strong super. If they jump in and they don't hit you, then you'll just get low strong super. They have to parry all 6 hits. Plus, most characters can't do shit after they parry it, because they'll be on the other side. Um, I did it, like, once. Or I tried to do it against that guy once. Oh my god, this is terrible. This fucking patch didn't do shit. Didn't do shit. This is goddamn terrible. So, I, I know I put my Facebook on, like, my earlier videos on my c -word Teaches series. But you don't have to do that. You don't have to add me on Facebook. My Facebook's pretty boring. It's it's pretty boring. The third strike tournament tomorrow, I think, at HQ, because Cyrus is running it, and I don't, I don't think I can go because of that shoe sale. Plus, I don't want to go because I love my girlfriend. I try to spend time with her whenever I can. I don't spend a lot of time with her. I try to spend like maybe three days a week with her. You know, sometimes only for like a couple hours, but you know, whatever I can do. This street photo stuff's not going to be more important than. Uh, my relationship. 
before when I was younger it was games before girls because I know that girls were too expensive so games were obviously cheaper Knight Rider 82 I'm born in 82 oh god can't see a ping alright we'll try it out let's take a risk what does it mean when there's a question mark does that mean like I'm still in the process of pinging <laughs> cause it's gonna time out eventually I mean I'm a network guy oh my god why are you using that super I'll use the second super I'm gonna try to land the stand roundhouse into super. Did you know that Dudley can move across the screen uh, with the second super if you hold down in all three punches? Terrible, buddy. Stop using the super. What? Did I win or not? Jump strong. Because it hits high. game, buddy. <laughs> He's gonna jump hurricane now, watch. See? I tried to parry that. <laughs> Even the super. <sighs> Alright, time to land the super on you. Stand roundhouse, Link. Oh god. What the hell are you doing? Jab uppercut. Or not. Hope you enjoy this video of uh, pure bullshit. Subscribe to me on Twitter at RoidRedRoid and subscribe to this YouTube channel pretty please. Leave a comment. What do you want to see? What characters do you want me to use? Um, I'll give it a shot. I'm not very good at a lot of characters though. I mean I'm good but I'm, I'm, I'm only good. I'm not very good at that many. And leg makes it worse. Alright, take it easy. Peace. P.S. you're gay. <laughs>